Hello folks and welcome back to Survival Challenge here on New Man's Land. And we got a lot of stuff to do today. So in last episode we created what's going to be our final mega field. Or our final big field, I won't call it a mega field. But what we want to do today is seed said field. But we need to lime the field. We've done the rock picking. We've got 2,700 years. Also, what I've gone and done is bought some more stones for the gold production. So, if we have a look here, 56 grand from the wood chip, so not too bad. So, if we go up here, so yeah, we had about what 44,000 here. So, I pretty much filled up the rock picker with stones we purchased for about 20 grand or so. So, yeah, we're going to use that to get gold. We're only on the, was it, signage at the, I'll deal with that later on, I think, at the moment. We've got a few things to deal with, so, actually what we can do is, I want to keep that gold production going, so. Oh, heck it, let's buy some more stones, so, this will hold X amount of stones, I can't remember, I think it was a million litres, so, this will take a while. So yeah, 41 grand that costed so far, so what I'm going to do is detach that, I'm going to leave that going, hopefully that will fill up over time. So yeah, one thing I want to do before we end the series is just have a bunch of gold cells, so heck it, we've got money, why not? So whilst that's doing that, we need to start doing the we need to light it first before we can drill, so... As we head down here, we'll get this hooked up to the John Deere cedar. I'm sorry, planter, sorry, because we're doing... corn here, so... Let's go and get this hooked up. Oh, it's already hooked up. hooked up to the other case. What? Well, fair enough. This could go... over here. And we'll get it hooked on to the was it herbicide spray or whatever herbicide or liquid fertilizer, but Ooh, a little jump there. I saw that, I saw that little jump. But yeah, anyways, we still do herbicide work. We do a bit of fruit spray and all that other good stuff, so what do we have in here? Ah, a liquid fertilizer. Uh, end of the road. That I can live with. Animals are being fed. We do have grass to cut. But I think we'll do that in the next episode or something. So we need to hop in here. Yeah, so we need to start the line. Which one thing I will do first of all. Well, that is winding the bills because. When this is fully loaded with lime, it does get very tipsy, Toppy. And there's been a fair few times where we've gone and tipped this over with said lime in here. So fertilizer is just about get away with all. Perhaps they still need to be cautious, but not as much compared to said lime. So get that filled. And then we'll head over to the field. And there we go, so start liming. I have no idea what the width is, so yeah, about yay big, so yeah. Let's start with a little quick time lapse, get all this done, and then we'll start doing the drilling.
there we go. We are done, we have lined, and we are just doing the actual strip of fertilizing. And yeah, when done this, because I knew we could do it straight after the line, so I thought before anything else gets done, let's fertilize the field. So now we have a look. That should be all patchiness to a nice clear dark blue. And yeah, I've seen Aussie apart from that area, we'll forget about that, but across the board, we are golden. And now that brings us on to the drilling, so yeah, we think about drilling that, and it has been a bit of a conundrum for me. Because personally, I'm thinking, will this be the last crop we be putting into the ground? Because in my initial plans were do two years with the grapes and that. I may still do, I'm not too sure yet. And technically the grapes do regrow, don't need to replace the vine, so there's nothing I say we can't do that. But yeah, I'm just thinking Do we do that? This will be our last crop going in. So we'll do the harvest this year. So yeah, our last harvest would be when November time for when we do the corn harvest, fine enough. Actually no it won't be because we can do silage early, so I don't know, not doing make silage, we're doing uh what's it cereal. So yeah, last harvest will be in November. And then we'll go from there. Get everything done, get everything processed, and then call it quits, round off the series. We'll easily hit 10 million by then, and I completely forgot stones are purchased. I didn't even look at the figure now, so yeah, I do wonder should we end the series after? Should this be the final crop, basically? Or do we do another full year of planting? Because I'm thinking. If we do go down that route, what should we do? I'm thinking something, something big and bash to go out on. Something like a, I know could be wood chips and that. What I mean by doing planting poplar and that, and then get poplar bells out of it. Could do that. Yeah, I mean, oh, I just generally don't know, like. Basically, we're doing what we need to do to get sugar cane for the sugars and that, corn for cereal, corn for the clothes, barley we we'll be harvesting either this episode or next episode for the flour and that. Yeah, generally I don't know, like, maybe just do a simple one big final harvest. Do we do the root crops? I don't know when this is going to go out, either before episode 51 of Court Farmers or after. Depends on how long this episode takes. If it does, it'll be before, but anyways, if it is, spoiler alert, skip ahead about 10 15 seconds. We have planted root crops there and pretty a decent size. And with that what I'm gonna do is when we do harvest it, use the what's it the D Wolf equipment as part of the premium expansion to do that. One of the root crops and then not use the premium expansion so I could use either like the closest one or make it with the what was it the T four four E Homer Terados thing. Whatever it's called. I think you can just go down to a route like that. Do a big, massive root crop harvest. Whether or not we'll process it, I don't know. But yeah, if we do down that, what should we do? Like merge all the fields together, including the grass fields. Get rid of those trees and that, so it'll be just like one massive final field and that. If anything, we could probably go out, ugh, 
I'm creating more work for myself, so let's just purchase the entire map in that. Do we do that? So that's the thing, like, do as I say, purchase the entire map, got the money, flatten everything, and do one big old harvest. I've never done that before. And the terrain is, yeah, I won't say flatten everything out, Christ, no. That will literally take, what, hours, I'll say, just get everything prepped and that will take at least 12 hours to do. I'll say prep that, by the time you do all the landscaping, cut down all the trees, see where it's, whether or not we get wood chips from it or not. It's like, yeah, I don't think, actually, comment down below what you want to do. A couple of options. Big old mega harvest at the end of the series. Stop doing. So yeah, basically, it's mega harvest at the end of the series. Continue on for a second year and that. Off doing just normal crops and that. Or do we say this is a final harvest? Once we're done, let's process everything once we've done the final harvest in November. And that can easily take, what, 12 months or so, like, the sugar in that, the vineyard. That can easily take 6 to 12 months to process, easily. But then once it was all said and done, oops, smacked the controller there. It's just not everything. We will get the pallets in that. And yeah, just go do a big old final selling. So I think all said and done, once we sell everything, I don't see why we can hit 20 million. I know I said all oh, the gold's going to be oh, 10 million, but generally speaking, with all the gold we're going to be producing from that million years of stone, I am generally thinking we can have 20 million quid. Really? As I was about to say, the epic moment. Christ. Christ on a mirror cycle. 20 million quid, basically. Yeah, I've got a couple of options. Yeah, comment down below. Let me know what you think. I ain't gonna do any batch recordings for a while, I don't think. I might do this episode, next episode, and that. If I was here, it's gonna be a week or two before we get to the point off where or not we say is this a final harvest or a final planting or what yeah so yeah let me know but anyways we are what I'll say a third of the way done third to yeah not quite half but maybe just over a third of the way done so yeah let's get us planted we do have another planter, and I've got a strange suspicion that is... No, it's not there. Where is that other planter to? For now, I'll get the work on that, because we do have a second one. Uh, do, 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 own equipment. Oh god, I've got so many equipment, so... I'll say that one, show on the map. That is over here. We, I did put in storage. I didn't, for a moment, didn't think we did put in storage. So, yep. Yeah. That's got a little bit of seed in it. So, yep. Yeah. Let's say, get this out, hook it up, get everything seeded off the corn, and then we'll get it all rolled.
And there we go. We are done with the corn. Oops. Forgot to put it in gear there. So yeah, what we're gonna do now is first of all quickly top up the gold production because I forgot about it. I had this running out of stone, so yeah, let's just use our million liters of stones as you do. Oh no, 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 don't, don't tip. Do not tip out. Don't tip, don't tip. Phew, I was gonna say, phew. Well, that would have been disastrous if that all fell out. A uh, swivel axle tractor, uh, uh, or swivel tractor and swivel dolly. Yeah, this is why I hate this. Oh, it helps if you actually had the right things. Uh, we'll just ignore that. Yep, students are going in, and that is 30% used. So, we'll put that. Don't know why it's sounding a weird accent in. Anymore? Nope. What was that, a, a Russian ac accent I was trying to put on there? Yeah, no. No, ain't gonna go down that route. I'm gonna find the people of Russia. Oh, God. Let's, anyway, so... Since... What was all about corn? Yeah, corn's done, corn's sorted, so... I think what we can do, what's down there, is just casually do our... All stuff off getting things sold, getting things moved about. There we go. Well, maybe not doing this episode, maybe do it for the next episode, but just checking on our productions. Yoast's pancakes are delicious and doing well. Are these all close? Close, close, close. See, so, yeah, that'll be dealt with. How much sight have we got left? 269,000 litres. And also, how is our methane production going? So, cause that's going to be a thing we need to keep an eye on. Silage we're not touching at all. But things like manure and that we will touch. Yeah, just sort of keep that keep that up and if needed we will use silage as and when it's needed actually what the heck I just use that potatoes sugar beet why not but I just think we can use but oh, I don't really want to because it is such a waste I've got another pad of donuts spawned so there we go but yeah, how much? Actually, how much is for a while? What do we have? Six hundred and forty thousand liters of digesting. So yeah, not too bad. These are dry. Why are you dry of silage? Eh? Oh, I mean, you're to deal with as well. That's the thing. Like our cows are not producing manure at all. I'm not too sure why though. Like, this entire series since I've had those cows, we've not produced a single bit of manure, so. Because if we go to our animals and that, obviously it won't shop on this menu anyways, but we've got a manure heap next to it, so. Chickens are fine for foods, cows could do more food. Yeah, like, sorry at the moment, 149,000 litres. 30,000 litres of milk, not too bad. Wool, we're getting full, we need to move those at some point. But yeah, I just don't know what is... Yeah, like... Come out of here. And, yeah. Put a manure heat down. Zero litres. Unless we put something else down. Actually, let's try that a second. See, barely than never sorting this out, but okay, we'll go to our buildings, go to silos. Yeah, that is the base game manure heap. Is there any manure heaps that's part of this cow pen? 
that I may have missed in that, so... Bunker silo sets, modulars, no. None of these I know for sure. No my sands, no my sand bell storage, no. Silos, no. Pallets. Pallet factory, pallet storage. Oh, I forgot, I've got so many productions and that's so many mods. Yep. Yeah. No more in your heap. Unless it's silo extension, is it? Can't be. Yeah, an animal heap needs to be placed next to a barn. Wait a minute. What? All this time, we could be producing our own manure. Yeah, it says manure heap and that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even with free mode enabled, so toggle free mode is on. It's on now, so. Could place it there, place it there. Manure heap needs to be placed near a barn. So, me, all this time. You've got to be joking. So that you can place it there. Oh, you son of a gun. Actually, what? I want to do a test here. Place that down there. It's only just grass. I don't care. Let's go and save the game. Because, yes, if this is... If this is actually going to work, I am going to be absolutely annoyed. Like, literally millions of quid, millions of pounds. You've got to be joking me. All this time, this entire series, we could have been producing manure. And producing 3,333 litres a month, a week. Not a week, an hour. So, yeah, doing the math out is what? 33, 66, 70, 80,000 years of manure we're producing a month. I am so stupid. How long have this series been going on for? Six years. We're on year six, so. Year six, 257 hours. Oh, f f freaking hell. Like, seriously. Uh, you know what? Oh, I'm speechless. Like, all this time we could be producing our manure. And you know what? I think that's where we're going to leave it today, so. Yeah. Better late than never, as I saw it. But yeah, next time, what we'll be doing is the mowing and the harvesting. So, got to mow all the grass, that's going to be fun. I may do what I did before with the triple mirror setup, or should we do a little test on what's better, the mower with the hitch option, and what was it, the stick picker forge wagon thing we've got, that's what we've got at least at the moment, that white one at the shop, we can try that, versus the Colossus stuff. Because you, know, you can mow at 120 odd miles an hour, I think, is. Obviously, with control issues, of course, but. I do wonder, though. Should we do that instead? Let's. Maybe even let's do a little test between the two. See what I prefer now. See what's more effective. And obviously, it may help you all folks as well at the same time, so. Together we can learn what's the best merch set for Farm Simulator 22. We want to go OP and just crazy with all. But anyways, I said that's where we're gonna leave it today. As always, hope you enjoyed the episode. If so, smash that button. Feel free to down below. If you want to share some, please be my guest. If you not subscribed channel yet, then please consider. But for you to do, hope you're nice today. But for now, it's been far more extreme. 
and I'll see you all very soon.